So the crisis has affected my life a little bit, but I feel really lucky uh, for lots of reasons. I feel really lucky to live on Vashon Island and all the friends we have here and so on. And, and in a funny way, I feel lucky that it, it hasn't really affected my style of art in that I work in a studio uh, by myself, so that goes on as usual. But uh, all this extra time because of the lack of distractions uh, has been good. And I've been able to work on all kinds of things. I've been drawing a lot of little images, nothing new, and these images are all being added up, lots and lots of little images of people and so on, and all of this is being put together into a really big uh, installation piece. Uh, this is going to be about 24 feet tall, and it's given me a chance to really sit here and try to figure all this stuff out. These people are all life-size. I am kind of excited, but a little bit scared how this is going to come out, and it's for the National Guard. And I think they're busy right now, so we'll see. It seems like every day I've got to spend at least a couple hours in front of these big computer screens doing the Photoshop work that's part of my illustration and my art forms, uh, which is okay, but uh, in order to get out of the house, I have always taught a couple of different classes uh, on the island and off the island, and I, and I really enjoy the contact with the people. I didn't want to give that up, so I converted all those classes to Zoom. And I built this background behind me so that I could project from the computer. And I literally use this as the sort of the board that I that I teach from. And students seem to like this. It seems it seems to work fine. I do everything I would do in a classroom. But you know, the real reason I, I built this backdrop was the rest of my studio is a total mess, and I don't want anyone to see 